Yeah, but obviously second grief and then peel thoughtsies for the summer's pack and the Magus of the Moon. Yeah, of course. Of course, Brad. Here well, we go. look, you just have to get better at magic. I don't know. You know what here's the you. thing. Here's the thing. We talked about how old we are and how some things never change. This includes, <laughs> this includes what just happened here, which is, you know, not the luckiest, didn't play the best. You played better and got a little lucky. And that's that. It is really nice when a game gets really tough and I don't know what I'm supposed to do and my deck just tells me. Yeah, it looks like, here it is. I got yeah. you. Here's you the easy win, win, Brad. Just take it. All right, I will. But also, I played a garbage deck and I played medium at best. So I got what I deserved. I hope you enjoy watching me in top eight like you have so many times before. <laughs> All right, so we, we see uh, the, the graphics are wrong right now. Cedric Phillips is not playing a playable deck. I'm, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but we have, we have Arya playing, uh, a really fast start, right? Just having that uh, Lotus Field down yeah, a turn, early. A turn one Lotus Field and a turn two the One Ring? Yeah, it's, that would be classified as a fast start, yes. <laughs> Wait, how is that even possible? I mean. Oh, the Vesuva comes down and copies, wow. Yeah, it copied Crumbling Vestige, trigger, get a green, uh, play another Grazer, Lotus Field, sack two Vestiges. And now next turn, play a ring, and, you know, the game is, I mean, we'll keep playing. I mean, what 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 is nice, though, is, you know, the, the two Regabans against the two Grazers, a lot, along with the Tarmogoyf, that's, that's a 1-2. Yeah, absolutely. I guess the 2-3, excuse me. Well done. Way to, way, to, way, to, way to notice the artifact. I'm proud of you. Yeah, and so, I mean, it's so difficult with everything with the, the shiny right now. Oh, a third Regaban. Third Regaban. That is justice. Oh, uh, is the scape shift just game over? I wouldn't surprise. I guess not yet. No, no, no. It's it's the one ring. Look, I don't know. Arya's deck is weird. If you told me scape shift is game over right now, I'd believe you. Oh yeah, when when it happened against me, I didn't, I didn't realize that it was going to do that, and yeah, I was very I scared. Yeah, I was like, oh okay, Brad might be dead now. Oh, a lightning bolt. All right, so this is just uh. I mean, this hand straight up is is uh, is what I played a few years ago, the the Jun Sagavon deck, and it wasn't that good then. Yeah. <laughs> that was uh, <laughs> I was testing for a for for a, a, a big tournament, and uh, <laughs> Javier Dominguez convinced me that cutting one of my four regavans for a dark confidant might be correct, and I did it. <laughs> really? Yeah, I top it. Yeah, all right. So we have oh, there's so much gas over there. Uh the only thing slowing things down is uh not having an amulet. So R is not gonna be able to have any shenanigans happen this turn. At least we don't think so. So right, like this looks like this looks like Lotus Field just activate Aga make a construct and not play any of the bounce lands. Uh, that's what it looks like. That's what, yeah, okay. So that's that's all that's gonna happen this turn. That's easy enough. I was wondering because you have that arboreal grazer. If you play the land and put the lotus field back in it, no, because it, nothing untaps. There you go. Yep. Yeah, that's it. I was thinking if you could sack enough lands to use, yeah, no, nothing untaps. All right, all my lines need an untap. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and the brick breakout. Oh, yes. I am. Actual I... brick, really? I am here for I was the luckiest person happening. in the world, you. And now I get to watch this nonsense. It is unbelievable. I mean, that Tarmogoyf got in. I mean, that, that, I mean, breakout did, did uh, give Tarmogoyf plus one, plus one. A positive respect. Yeah. All right. So I was going to drop. Few more life points. Draw into an amulet. That's, that's, <laughs> into that's probably that's probably game. Can't imagine. Can't imagine how it's not game. No, yeah, because you're gonna have two amulets, and you can crew back the lotus field and untap, and then go get the thing that brings back all the lands. Yeah, the um, analyst. The analyst. Yeah. Yeah, that's. I mean, I'm just gonna. My feet are already up on my desktop right now, but. Yeah, I'm just going to kind of sit back and enjoy whatever nonsense is about to happen here. Eduardo, you're not going to get another turn. 
I guess unless you want it, but even still, I don't think you get one. And can you ask Will if we are paid uh, to, 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 all right, perfect. Respect. Respect. Yeah. That's it. I'm in. I'm in Value for that. everyone's time, including yours, Eduardo. You're dead. You know you're dead. Just keep it moving. Yes, I was I was just about to make a joke about all the triggers that we were going to see again. And I am I am glad we got through that. And I mean that's what I also appreciate about our match. It was uh like three minutes long. It was so short. Yeah, we didn't so even short. get yeah, I think we both had like 21 minutes left on our clock. Yeah, I'm dead. You know what I mean to do? You want me to you want me to let you put that rule log into play and then beat me to death with it? I'm well, yeah, giving, you should I'm not I giving mean, you the we satisfaction. Are, we are here for the fans. You should have let it happen. Right. But I did like the mini game of of uh, using like as little time as possible. Yeah, I'm a big fan. Absolutely. So some cards are getting moved around sideboard wise. <laughs> play that much? I can tell you right now that people are sideboarding. Yes, they. <laughs> good cards in, bad cards out. We are ready go. to begin yep. too. Yep, good ones in, bad ones bye bye. Let's see if let's see if Eduardo has enough good ones to bring in. The answer is no. Based off of this hand. Yeah, just just one land. Mostly garbage. <laughs> I mean, so so on the other side though, there is no colored mana. Um but there is the Urza saga and the, the garden. So there is turn three from Evil Titan. I wish I was smarter to know how valuable a hand like that is. A turn three Titan? Well, but like you have a turn three Titan, but the Slayer Stronghold is already in hand, right? Yeah, but you're still. But you have the strong. Grazer. Yeah, you don't pass up on. You don't pass up on. Like your Grazer is bad because you can't cast it. At least not yet. But you know, if you peel one off, like game's over. Basically. All right, so it's like a pretty. It's like a pretty high ceiling hand. If you peel a green source, you play Grazer, put Saga into play, and it's like the game's over. In two. All right, so Bobble gonna hit a Bobble force though. So that is, that is... oh to 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 also draw the garrison. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Well, I mean, I I still feel like shenanigans could be a foot when there's two amulets and this deck can do some wonky things. I I can see Titan coming down and doing some Teleria West action and. Yeah, I mean, what can happen, depending, again, I don't know Arya's deck nearly as well as Arya. Uh, okay, so that's three amulets. Now, uh, though it is worth mentioning that Eduardo does have a, a Seiju, but, I mean, at the very least, it could be, like, mere pool, copy Titan shenanigans. Like, yeah, that's like, that's like the floor with two amulets, for most amulets. I am going to go out on a limb and say Arya is going to find a line to win on turn three. With a 5% chance of winning this turn because I don't really understand the deck. It's been 10 years and I still never really get it. There's no So there's no 13 kill because there wasn't a turn one amulet? Um, well, well, this okay, deck well, has, lo this well, has Lotus Filled and Scape Shift. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, well, it's, not, it's not traditional, so I don't want to be... I don't I'm pretty sure there's no turn. Okay, that makes a green. All right. Oh, okay. This is cute. Want to get the stronghold onto the battlefield? Okay. And then double amulet. Go, go nutso next turn. All right. Triple amulet. Uh, yeah, yeah. I guess that's true. Saga finds one. You cast one, and then you you garden one, and then you can play Lotus Field, and then yeah, because if you have, later, yeah, because if you have triple, you can Titan for. The aftermath, and then that. I mean, oh, yeah. I, I'm pretty sure there's like three different transmute lines next turn. You can just. I, I I think it's just an infinite combo next turn. I think it's yeah. I think it might just be game over. Yeah, because Lotus Field being able to 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 sack everything really changes things. Yeah, I'm with you. I'm with you on that. This is this is some real nonsense. Kind of into it actually. It's like way too tough for my for my brain. But I'm into it. This is not too tough for your brain. You used to play decks like this. I have. Do you want to know a fun fact? I've never played a game with Titan. 
Yeah. Not a game. <laughs> Every time I've considered it, I just picked up Thoughtseize. <laughs> well, uh, you know, you're probably doing it right. I don't know if I've always done it right, but it is it is wild that I've just never wanted to to, to try it. I just default to Thoughtseize. It's fun. Like, the puzzle of playing Titan is pretty fun, honestly, but the games where you're trying to solve the puzzle and then you lose, and then, you know, you wake up at, like, 3 a.m., and you're like, that's what I was supposed to do. That's less fun. That's all. Yeah. It, it, uh, my, my only real experience with Titan is always thinking I have a bad matchup and then beating people in tournaments and then telling me I have a good matchup. Oh, yeah, that's, I mean, that's... It's yeah. every time. Again, some things never change. <laughs> but I just want to know what it's good against. Like, in, like I, I mean, it's very awesome here. This is a really cool deck. This version might convince me to jump on Mikko and play a little bit with it because it, it it's it's fresh and it's new and it's got like interesting lines to me. Like always doing the primeval titan thing seemed a little, you know, it was obviously powerful and one dimensional. And like now this deck has so many cool loops. And yeah, we got some dimensions here that again I I didn't know were possible until seeing these things happen. So like right now, this is Lotus Field. Six mana, sacrifice the two other lands, presumably. Uh, yeah, like and Titan. I might have missed it, but is this like a, a, a an Aria special, or is this like a version that's starting to pop up? Chat, can you help me out? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. That's a good question. Is it yeah, truly it's, impressive? Is this a Watsy staff? Bruce is this Pete? is this just flexing, saying, yeah, we 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 still know what we're doing, and we know what's going to happen, and we know like what we're doing in the future like we still got it okay i mean chat says aria special that, that's not chat that's will oh, i got a couple in there oh really oh, yep. yeah I got a couple I got, I got twitch open all right so okay so you see that was, that's what i was curious about was like lotus field uh mm, okay so now is there a way for us to give titan haste well, no, so what we can do here is is Telerian Academy, right? Because we're going to have how much mana? Say Telerian Academy one more time. Telerian Academy. Come on. <laughs> Telerian West. Telerian West one time, bud. But, like, so what are we doing here now? Oh, so this, like... Okay, so this is the Mirror Pool turn. This one I know because I do this one in Titan a lot. So this is, you get four triggers, you tap Mirror Pool for a colorless, you tap Grove Chamber for two green, two blue. Uh, and then you, and then with the last untap trigger, you don't, uh, you don't tap mirror pool. You have five mana, two blue, two green, and a colorless copy, uh, copy Titan. So you, this is the second copy of Titan. Okay, all yeah. right. So I, so I know this trick. So now you get your Titan copy. Okay, cool. Which means two more lands. And then this is where I would go get and where battlements and a Valakut and give both my Titans haste. But Slayer Stronghold is in play. And Boros Garrison is in the hand, so now I'm curious where we go from. Is so Lotus filled? Player Academy is eight mana, God. right? Three and six, that's eight. Yeah, and that's not enough. That's eight mana, but also, but also, you're not picking up your, uh, you're not picking up your, uh, your Teleri West. So okay, so oh, this is Suva for yes. Lotus. Yeah, so now you okay, can give so... two haste. Well, you can only give one haste, right? Because, well, uh, if you stack it right, yeah, you got to stack it right. So white and red. Yeah, okay. So good stacking by Aria. Dope. And so now haste, haste. Okay, that's cute. Good <laughs> this stacking. is so sick. Good stacking. Good stacking. Okay. And now it surely has to be a kill. Uh, Well, attacking for 16 at the min... Pick up Vesuvs, can't play a land. All right, you beat can, downs. But you can go get the uh, battlements in another Lotus Field. Right? Uh, so I don't know if there's another Lotus Field in the deck. Oh, I only see two, so there should yes. be a third. So Lotus, Lotus Field plus Sun Home. Mm, that's sounding right to me. Oh, let's see what we got I, here. I, I, guess, I guess I'm wrong. There's a Gruel Turf and something else. The Gruel Turf and it's Lightning. Okay, so Gruel Turf, Celestian Sanctuary. Oh, yeah, okay, so dead. So first Titan is Gruel Turf, Celestian Sanctuary. Oh, yeah. That's eight. That's eight. And then the next one is Sun Home plus another land. And then that's double activation of Sun Home on each Titan. Brain. 
brain huge, not mine, Arya's. I mean, this deck looks. Um, I, I'm, I'm, uh, like, I'm being 100 percent sincere. This is like one of the coolest things I've seen. I actually in totally modern agree. in a long time. Yeah, I, I mean, totally it's, agree. it's it's like changing the way the deck is like played. Like the, these lines are not possible without Lotus Field. Yeah, like this this actually just kind of feels busted. If I'm being honest. Yeah. You know, because like there's a bunch of lines like we don't even know how the deck even really works, right? We're just kind of watching it happen. Like we don't know all the scape shift lines at all. Lotus Field is providing just obscene amounts of mana and value. And that's before we even get into the analyst nonsense. Yeah, this is this is this is truly a work of art. And and Arya deserves is the only person of the four of us that deserves to move on to the I agree. To the top I absolutely agree. Yeah, no, no one else deserves it. <laughs> I earned my O O two O four. No games played effectively. Uh, so I'm you know I'm happy with that. But yeah, this is this is pretty dope. Assuming there's a sun home in the deck. Uh I couldn't I couldn't see taking it out. Yeah, there, there it is. is. Brad, what's my tilt what's my tilt meal tonight? I'm curious. Your tilt meal? Yeah, after just an embarrassing display. What, what city are you in again? I live in Denver. You live in Denver? Yeah. This is who I have access to whatever. Just roll up to to, to Lisa's house and make him cookie something. <laughs> You'd be very tilted to do that. <laughs> well, see, I've had a I've had a tough go of it. What happened? I registered Tron. Yeah, that would kick me out. <laughs> uh, what's your tilt mill? Uh, I don't actually know what uh, what's great there. I, I I know what my victory mill is going to be. I'm, I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna go I'm gonna go get me some ramen. Yeah, that can be my tilt meal. Your vic this is how the meals work in magic. You know this. It, it's it's the same meal. It just it, did I win or did I lose? It's either a tilt meal or a victory meal. Arya is gonna but, have. But, but at the end of the day, we eat. <laughs> that's right. I, I, Arya can have the best meal after this because this was sweet. You're dead. Uh, that is. Uh, the, I mean, I I I am in love with this deck. Like it good looks block, real good block. Good block. I would have blocked the other one. That's why you're two and I'm with two. <laughs> that, that is true. Yeah. The margins are that razor thin. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they sure are. <laughs> they sure are. That's right. All right. Well, well, that was that was exceptionally convincing. <laughs> <laughs>